hello guys welcome back to another video of automation test insider so today i'm going to talk about defect age so let's get started what is a defect age so the time difference between the time difference from defect found date to defect close date is called defect age so let's say 28th of this month we found the defect and in the next month fifth of the next month it got closed so what is the difference so here we have 15 days so 15 days is nothing but the defect age so this is calculated in days or in hours when the testing team identified the defect and when the defect is fixed so the difference between when we identified the defect and when defect is fixed to know how much time it take to fix the defect by developer so what is the use of this defect age matrix right so to know how much time it take to fix the defects by the developer so this is nothing but the defect age the defect fixed date may be the past date on which defect is fixed or the current date if it is still open or unresolved okay guys so it is not mandatory like uh, when we fix the defect then we can calculate this defect age if defect is still open state or it is in unresolved state so till that date what is the difference so that is again we can say defect age the, uh, we can calculate that particular day, uh, the difference between between those days right the defect age is calculated based on the two factors parameter so there are two factors guys one we can calculate based on the time and another one is using phase software development phases okay i'll explain so defect age in time so how we can calculate so defect age in time is the difference between the time of the defect detection and defect fixing means when the testing team identified the defect and when the test uh, when the defect is fixed mainly this defect age is calculated in days or in hours as i have discussed earlier so how to calculate defect age in time so this is the formula guys defect age in time defect fix solve date or current date if it is open state defect detection date or identification date the way uh, the date when we got the defect correct so defect fixed date or it is uh, the open state of the defect the day on which uh, still it is open right minus defect detection date or identification date the day on which we got the defect defect age in fees so how we calculate how we can calculate defect age in fees defect age in fees is the difference between the phases of defect injection fees and defect detection fees here the phase refers to the difference phases of sdlc how to calculate defect age in phase so this is the formula defect age in phase defect detection identification fees minus defect injection origina originated origination fees right so let me just give you an example so we have different phases in software development life cycle guys we have requirement analysis we have uh, coding sorry design design then coding then unit testing integration testing system testing acceptance testing and maintenance finally right so let's say we found the defect in coding phase and it is detected in integration testing okay it is detected in the defect is originated in the uh, coding phase but it is detected in integration phase integration testing phase so here is the formula defect detection identification phase uh, so it is identified in integration phase and defect injection or originate origination phase so it is originated in coding phase so what is the difference two right so there is a difference of two phases so the defect age should be uh, will be two here so this is how we calculate defect age in phases so this is all about today guys so if you have any doubts then write your uh, question in the comment box of this video please like and share this video and if you are new to my channel then please subscribe it thank you for watching have a nice day bye bye